I did everything within my power to help your friend. But I'm afraid it's too late. Nothing can save him now. Sylvie told me. Nightshade? What are you going to do with that? You realize it's deadly. I promised Sylvie I'd give it to him. To end his suffering. I don't know what that wildling told you. But that will kill him and taint his blood. You? It's me, Cotter. I'm here. Where's Sylvie? I want to see her. Where is she? Did something happen to her? She can't see you right now. But don't worry. She's fine. I thought, I thought they took her away. Behind. Ah, to help Sylvie. Got her. Oh, I can't bear it anymore. He's been incredibly brave. A lesser man would have died days ago. But I suppose you already knew that about him. Got a fighter. Always has been. <laughs> I can see that, but now you can use this death to give his life meaning. This was always intended for my father. It's a sacred symbol of the power of the North Grove. Forged from iron, the handle made with ironwood from this very tree. In my father's absence, you speak for House Forrester. It seems only right that you should have this now. You're here for a reason, Garrett. It's no accident they sent you. I promise. I'll make Lord Forrester proud. I know you'll do what's necessary. Your friend is dying. But his life is too valuable to waste. Give me his heart. His beating heart. And his death can have meaning. We can use it for a greater purpose, Garrett. An ancient ritual to help harness the power of the North Grove. But... We must do this, Garrett. I fear what might happen if we don't. His beating heart. This is madness. Not madness. Necessity. Madness would be letting the North Grove fall. You saw what happened after the fight. My warriors, they're pulling away. Please, I need you to do this. For me, for the North Grove. I'm ready. Garrett. Please. Can't take it any longer. End his suffering. Use his life to make us strong, Garrett. Give him that poison, and his blood will be useless. I'm sorry. But I can't do it. Cotter's my friend. I wouldn't be here if not for him. And I have to respect what Sylvie asked me to do. Then so be it. Gorn Bison Air.
We must burn the body. In the name of the King, I hereby sentence you to death. has been charged with murdering a loyal servant of the king. Who here bears witness to his crimes? My betrothed can speak to them. Is this true, my lady? My lady! Then in the name of the king, I sentence you to die. Lady Mira, please! Please! This isn't right! Help me! Come along, Mira. I have a busy day ahead. <laughs> <laughs> 